here we go. <coughs> Avon Speedmaster, 3 inch by 21, fit to a 21 inch front wheel, obviously it's not going on a 25 inch or a 19 inch, um, pretty straightforward, we hope, let's do it. Remember lesson one, always fucking check that the inner tube's not pinched. Something funny's going on. There's a leak. This is pretty concerning. So, um, an interesting thing. I, uh, I put me uh, tyre on and uh, went to blow it up and it's leaking. Turns out I had uh, four little bite holes in it. I wonder who that could have been. So I'm just waiting for uh, Adam to bring me a new inner tube. Yeah. And I seen her. Uh, the missus had a hold of this. And I seen her grab, went to grab it and we she just checked it. I said, looks alright. And she literally had it for half a second. And fucking managed to do this to it. We've got our tyre on. Um, we've got our tyre on. And um, I don't know what it is about bikes and tyres. This bike, I've had an absolute fucking shit show again. I put a um, inner tube, I put I put this, uh, I put the tire on the rim, pumped it up, and bang, went flat. So I went, well, oh, what's going on here? It, it, I thought I'd, but you know, like I'm like, it couldn't possibly have pinched it. Then I remembered that when we were standing at the back, I don't know if it's on footage yet because I haven't edited this, this video, obviously. But um, if it's there, I'll I'll put it in. Um, I had the inner tube, I think it was just like sitting on a box or on the ground and uh, Rexy, the puppy, fucking Kelpie, grabbed it and as she grabbed the inner tube, the missus just like, like I watched it, it didn't even look like the dog even grabbed it that tight and the missus just pulled it away from her and that was it and I said oh she didn't pierce it did she and she had a look at it and I, she just showed me and I went I don't know looks cool threw it back on the thing installed it then um, I'm getting getting it I put it on 
bang, you know, get everything in, it's leaking. I'm like, what? So I thought it was the valve. Nah, it's not the valve. So pull it all back off again and go, huh, it's got a couple of little holes in it uh, close together. And I went, the fucking dog. It must have bit it. Why didn't I, why didn't I see it? So um, I call up Adam and he's leaving work. And I said, do you reckon you can call into this bike shop, pick me up? A new inner tube, you wouldn't fucking believe it, the dogs bit it. And all this anyway, ha uh, ha ha, you're a fuckhead and all this sort of thing. I'm a dickhead. All good. Brings me down the new inner tube. I got an audience, we're putting it all back in. Everything's good. Adam's giving me a hand. Uh, Colin, I think, was there helping. Um, we chuck it in. Go to blow it up. Bang, it's, it's well, it didn't go bang. Go to blow it up and it goes, um, uh, it's going down again. I couldn't couldn't get it to go up and I'm like, what the hell is going on? So that time, I'm like, well, I know the dog definitely hasn't got it. I must have pinched it. Like, I've never pinched an inner tube and caused, caused that, but um, I thought, oh, well, I, I must have, like, what, why else would it be leaking? You know, my bad. So I pulled that inner tube out and I compared it to the old inner tube and these cuts or these little holes were in the same spot. So uh, we're checking it out, we're going around the inside of the rim. I, I didn't film any of this because I was that fucking over it and we were just you know trying to get things done and lo and behold inside the wheel was a piece of i don't know like just a burr sticking up and i don't know how i didn't see it it like it was small it but it was small enough that if you run your finger into it you'd catch your finger so when i didn't have the tube exactly lined up or whatever um I've, I've moved it a bit and I've cut it each time. Two fucking inner tubes. Um, so I worked out where it was, fold it down a little, fold it down. And uh, then I've also run some duct tape around the hole inside of the, uh, the wheel, just in case, because I didn't want to put it back on. So I, I've, I repaired the tube that was in here and um, I've put it back back on and uh, I don't know what it is with <laughs> me and put changing tyres on this bike at the moment but I've just had nothing but bad luck um, but anyway it's on there um, picked up a front wheel uh, didn't have to go too far for that um, not the exact design or anything like that I want, you know, I'd love to get one with the narrow glides, um, mini spool, no room, nowhere to put a front brake because I don't run them, uh, where I can, if, if you're a cop or transport, I'm just saying that I definitely run a front brake, um, but I'm just saying that to look cool, um, but I'll, I want to, um, so anyway, this is this is going to do. I've tracked down some bearings. They are absolute another pain in the ass ordeal um, that no one seems to have at the moment. But um, I ended up getting some of them. So uh, anyway, what I'll what I'll probably do now is um, I'll uh, this is just sort of a, to end this video and uh, the next video will be I've got to put the bearings in and uh, which is nothing they should just slide straight in they should on, on, I think <laughs> they should slide straight in then what I'm going to do is mount this to the Springer front end um, and I need to make the spaces and everything like that to suit so um, 
that's all on the next one. Done.